So our gospel reading this morning is taken from Matthew chapter 25 verses 14 to 30. So Jesus said, what else can we use to picture the kingdom of God? It's like a man who is going to travel to a faraway country. Before he goes, he calls together his servants and distributes his talents, his silver coins, amongst them. To the first, he gives five bags of silver coins. To the second, two. To the last one, one bag of silver coin. And then he travels to a faraway country. The man with five bags of silver coins puts them to work and makes five more bags. The servant with two bags of silver coins puts them to work and makes two more bags. But the one with one bag of silver coins digs a hole and buries the silver coins. A long time afterwards, the man comes back from his travels and he calls his servants together. I want a full account of what you've done with my money. The first man says, Master, with the five bags of silver coins that you gave me, I put them to work and made five more bags. Here you are. Well done, good and faithful servant, he says. Come and rejoice with me and you'll have responsibility for much more. The second man says, here, master, with two bags of silver coins you gave me, I've made two more bags. The master says, well done, good and faithful servants. With the little I gave you, you've made much more and you'll be given more responsibility now. Come and rejoice with me. But the man who had one bag comes and says to his master, Master, I knew you were a cruel and harsh man and that you harvest where you do not sow and gather where you, you did not plant. So I took the bag and I was afraid of losing it, so I dug a hole and I buried it. I'm a harsh and cruel man, am I? And I harvest where I do not sow and, and reap where I do not plant. At least you could have put it in the bank and got some interest with it, says the master. Take his money away from him and give it to the one who has been got the ten silver bags. Because to those who have and use it and make more, they will be added. But to the one who has little and doesn't put it to good use, it will be taken away from him. Then the master says, take this useless and lazy servant and throw him into outer darkness where there is crying and gnashing of teeth. Here ends the reading.